Hi everyone, welcome back to our program Crystal Series. In the last episode, we climbed the lighthouse, but we need to go to Sienwood, to Sienwood Pharmacy, before we go to take on the Olivine Gym Leader, as uh, there is a Pokemon that needs some help. We will need to surf down. Then we'll claim our Route 40 encounter first, because you never know, my fighting is good. The last dice is pretty good. Is it as strong as for alligator? No, we'll try and catch it though. One bullet? Yeah. Um we'll call it uh we'll call it shocker. No, but it gives us another strong one in case we lose um, the alligator. Oh, what else could we have had? A tentacle. Tentacle, not tentacle. Face evolution. I don't know that's higher level. Oh no. I had to go around the train enough, but. Maybe they shouldn't have much we do have in me too. Is a Lapras. Lapras does have Ice Beam and um, thing. We should be fine to switch into Squiggle. But I don't think it has Ice Beam at level 23. No, it does have Confusory. Right? That can be a uh, That can be irritating. We break through. And he puts us to sleep with him at the very next time. His body slam. He was to sleep. Body slam's doing very often. We're still confused as well. <laughs> it's kind of ironic, is it? We're still confused. There's really bad confusion, but. That was a crit, so I'm gonna heal uh, with my super potions. Man, I'm pretty certain I might, must not have healed before. Was that off? Oops. Really? It manages to get the, get the prizes for like a 10% chance. Great. This Lapras is trying to stall us. <laughs> Very good. Can it stop hitting itself in confusion? When we do break free confusion with the end of the entire There we go. I could I, I could have used a crit though, really. We'll just heal again. I mean, I probably, I probably should have switched to somewhere that wasn't paralyzed, but... Yeah, there we go. We break through the confusion. Um, and a Blastoise. I'll stay in, because I use Absorb to recover health. Absorb should do a decent bit. To get the flinch. Back to back flinches. I think that's more common, more, more of a high percentage than um, causing um, paralysis in a body slam. I think. Don't know what the percentage chances are. If you do, let me know in the comments below. I think it's like a 10% chance of body slam causing a paralysis. And it got a, it got a crit. It's gonna keep it's gonna keep healing. This train has not been nice. Like, are you like are we being serious?
probably the worst look ever. If not being flinched or being fully paralyzed. There we go, that should be the end of last dice. Nope, cause it cause it hangs on for one more. There we go. We very few the paralysis. There we go. God spikes be though, which is what which is really good. Also a mega drain. Yes. We'll get rid of absorb. We'll upgrade absorb to a better version. In present power wise it goes absorb, mega drain, giga drain. Oh. Right tentacle. Tentacle. And not a bad Pokemon. Um no. Root for employ what? Couldn't really get employed, bad trainer. We do have a new encounter. We're changing roots. Um send out a stand though. We can't use Shadow Ball, we can use confusion though. Just half, and we get the. I think that's like quite low as well, getting confusion from confusion. I think. Worst looking at last battle though. <laughs> like, you can blast us, must have got um, four flinches, if not more. Uh, Ladybird, we don't actually have. We do have a flying type, yes. So we'll switch into uh, Rocky. Our Dactyl. Please win attack. And at Kuno. Um, ice Flying. We don't really have anything for it. Really, so smart switching is Mewtwo, strongest Pokemon. I use Blue Shadow Ball. We get the special defense drop as well. Shadow Ball's animation though is really good. Cool. It's like, it's like, like a bouncing ball. <laughs> Our encounter it is a Mew. I'm not going to be able to one ball what one ball this thing. Smart switching might be squiggle, so we can try and put it to sleep, but I may mean, have been stupid. It's going to mega punch. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to heal. Using Super Potion. A pound of Mega Punch. Will you s try and break through the thing and use Sleep Powder? Put Mew, Mew asleep. <laughs> you need to have a Mew and a Mew too. You do. Okay, I, I think I think then we just gotta try and throw um throw Great Balls. I don't think I have much that can actually damage it. One, two, three. We caught a Mew. I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it Origin. That's fun. I think I'm gonna heal bit. If, while we get past it, to go past this trainer, just so that I can hopefully have a more full health. But our encounter is it, we now have a mute and a mute. Uh, do we have a. Yes, we do have a full heal. Just so we can get rid of the uh, paralysis. Because that trainer is unavoidable.
two Pokemon, a Pidgeot. We can't use Shadow Ball because it's got um, not its part normal type. So we'll just use Confusion. Use Whirlwind. That's gonna throw us out, which brings in bring in Steelix. So that's not terrible. We can just use Rock Throw. Rock Throw. Landing a Rock Throw after a Sand Attack. That's pretty impressive. And a Smeargle, we'll switch to Tank, for Rock Smash. Because it'll get to Rock Smash, and Rock Smash might not, well, well, won't do much to Tank. Now we get that slightly higher roll, which takes out in the second hit. We've had. Well, it been, the rank of encounter on this route was a alligator, so it would have been dupes. We get, we get past the trainer, but we do run into another encounter. Ooh, Greylith. See, Arcanine could have been good. And stuff to the right and down. Smeage doesn't seem totally uncommon, but find a Mewtwo. We've heard Mewtwo. We've heard Mewtwo. We've heard Mewtwo. We've heard Mewtwo. Okay, I can't get her in that train in that way. Thought I could, that's why I was trying to go that way around. Need to get our way to. Uh, sandwich. Okay, we need to go there. Alright, we need to fight this trainer because we can't avoid. Not all trainers are, are avoidable. Oh, like one Pokemon has a Seedra. Level 26 Seedra. Because she's only got one Pokemon. Seem, which seems to be the way it, what it is. Is levels seem to be. If you've got more Pokemon, they tend to be a lot more lower and varied. Where if you've got like one or two Pokemon, they tend to be on the higher level. Another encounter. Little Garlic. Think I'm nearly through to Sandwood. But don't fan. Don't think I can hit it. Wait. I should be too rock how we try to roll. Yeah, because it's rock ground. He's fear type, fear type swing 5. So even if it does hits me 5 times, we then use confusion. Yeah, crit. And we need to go left. This room, I need to buy repels. We need to go around right now. Every two steps, every two, every three steps, it's a d d encounter. <laughs> Probably should have slowed down. Allowed it to rotate. So if I want need a queen, I had a lot more trainers than I thought would have would have would have done. A lot more trainers on this route than I thought there were. Effective um, and a Pidgey. Uh, Pidgey will switch to Veal. We've got Steelix and we use Rock Girl. So Rock Girl lands after a sand attack, yet it misses without being sand attacked at all. Interesting. There we go, we've made it to the end, but we're gonna heal. And 
and then we're gonna go to the same pharmacy. Which gives us this uh, secret potion. And um, we'll take on the gym next episode. So that'll be close where we enter the episode. So thank you for watching. Give it a like, subscribe. Until next time, see ya!